Let's start computer class. Open your books on page number 44, lesson number 4, algorithms and flowcharts. Topic we will do today, algorithm. Before we start, let's discuss objectives. Algorithm helps to solve any problem on a computer by apply step by step method. Now look at your book. Every day we perform so many activities such as buying stationery, packing school bag, polishing shoes, doing homework. All these activities involve a series of steps in a sequence. Let's see it with the help of an example. Let's suppose I have to buy a phone from the internet. So there are series of steps involved in a sequence in this process. First of all, I have to log in to the website from where I want to buy a phone. Then I'll check the price. Then select a phone. Then select payment method like either it is a cash on delivery by debit card, credit card. Then place the order and at last the phone get delivered. Now look at your book on page number 44. There are steps given to brush your teeth. First step will be take your brush from the shelf, turn on the tap of the wash basin then rinse the brush and turn off the tap after that apply toothpaste on the brush then start brushing your teeth then clean the brush and rinse your mouth then take the tongue cleaner clean your tongue then rinse your mouth again finally you will get the desired result that is shiny white teeth and clean mouth. So these are the series of steps that is given in a sequence to brush the teeth. Now in the similar way we can give the instruction to the computer to perform specific task. The set of these instructions that is written in the sequence and that we give to the computer is called program or computer programming. Now if a programmer doesn't know that how to write the instruction in a correct form or he writes the wrong sequence of the instruction or he doesn't know that how to perform it manually then computer will produce wrong result. So to ensure that the instructions are written in a correct sequence, a programmer must be planned it logically before it is written. Now we will discuss about algorithm. What is algorithm? Algorithm is required to solve any problem on a computer. We apply the required methods step by step. This step by step procedure that we use to solve any problem is called an algorithm. There are some rules for writing an algorithm. Let's discuss that. First, an algorithm should be written in English-like language. Like the language we use to write an algorithm, it should be English one. Second, it should be written in simple manner. That is the algorithm we write, it should be simple so that everyone can understand. Third, each step should be written in sequence. Like the series of steps we use to write an algorithm, that all steps should be in a proper sequence. An input is required to write an algorithm. Now let's suppose if we want to get the result from the computer, first we have to give the input. We can give the input to the computer with the help of any input device, keyboard, mouse and we can get the output on the monitor. Today we have discussed algorithm, examples of algorithm and rules for writing an algorithm. 
नाउ डू प्रैक्टिस ऑफ दिस टॉपिक एट होम